he's the prince of the planet. Uh, plus, he's really good looking. Uh, hmm. He isn't bad looking. <laughs> no, no, no. I have my Garu. Uh, Mr. Dong King has earnestly pleaded that you please meet him. Hmm. It can't be helped then. I'll just have to see him myself to reject him. Where do we plan to meet? <laughs> Oh, my, my. We crashed into a fragile earthling. May he rest in peace. Could you be Prince Octo from Planet Octo Octo? Ah, you must be Mr. Dong King's daughter, Miss Ring Ring. That's not me. This here is Miss Ring Ring. Oh, I'm so glad to meet you. He is very handsome indeed. Darn, I want to go home now. <laughs> what? How could this be? Hoka, what are you doing here? <laughs> <laughs> what was that? <gasps> is her name Puka? Yes, it is. I've never seen such a tough female in my life. Wait, please! The moment I saw you, I didn't feel a thing. Let's just call off our blind date. Seems like you've been blown off by an alien. <laughs> How dare he reject me! I'll make him fall in love with me just so I can dump him! Puka! Huh? Please wait! Where are you heading to? Is that your pet, perhaps? I also love pets. <laughs> Wait! I've been searching for someone like you for a long time. Will you please accept my love? She just rejected my proposal. I've never met a woman so cool in my life! How annoying! Ayo, you're certain that prince's ideal type is a tough gal, right? Yes. According to the Alien Encyclopedia, inhabitants of Octo Octo tend to prefer those that are stronger than themselves. All right, then. Start the plan. Tobey! Hey! Hmm? I hate good looking guys like you. Let me teach you a lesson! <laughs> If I go out there and tackle all of them, that arrogant alien will fall in love with me. Hey, you villains! Keep your paws off the prince! <laughs> ring Ring, what are you doing here? Well, you seem to be in danger, so I came to save... I thought I told you we two cannot be. Please don't meddle in my affairs. Today. Puka? Puka, where are you? Huh? Puka's probably in the kitchen. Puka, are you in here? Who are you? I'm here to meet Puka. Are you servants working for her? I'm Puka's uncle. Oh, please accept my greetings, dear sir. Uh -huh. I would like to marry Puka, please, if you will allow me. I mean, uh, that's up to her to decide. I've brought the best ingredients from my planet. That smells wonderful. Look at that sprig. I want to chew it. Oh, Puka, huh? I've looked everywhere for you. Do you think I can take her? Sure. I actually kind of like you. Good luck to you. Yes. Probably won't work out, but... Uh... Aww. A handful of rotten autumn leaves, two spoons of spider snot. You sure this is what aliens like to eat? Yes, it says so here in the Alien Encyclopedia. You love my cooking for sure. That arrogant alien. I think that guy likes Puka. This is really interesting. Oh. Oh? Earth's beaches are so beautiful, just like your eyes. <laughs> oh, my. Huh? I was just passing by. What a coincidence. 
<laughs> With the weather so nice and all, I packed something. Let's eat together. I think Ring Ring likes that guy. So this is a love triangle? <laughs> Why isn't this... Where did you get such precious stuff? You see, I'm really interested in cooking, so I made it myself. It's top quality dog food. Dog food? I thank you for the dog food, but please, just let me go. I have no intention of loving you. What is it about me that you dislike? You really don't know. It's your head, shoulders, knees and toes, knees and toes. All of them are awful. I can't take it any longer. <sighs> How dare you, you stupid alien. <laughs> stupid alien. Ring Ring, please wait. I've never had anyone treat me that way before. It was awesome. I think I've fallen madly in love with you. Hmm, about time. I will show you my true self. Uh, what's that? This is the real me. So many women chased me for my looks, so I had to conceal my true self. I see. I will accept your love now, Ring Ring. Let's be together forever. <laughs> Let go of me, you alien slave! A love story with an alien. How romantic. Hop <laughs> it. Go away! <laughs> What you ladies making there? You know, tomorrow's Valentine's Day. We're making chocolate for our love interests. Oh, I see. Good luck, then. <laughs> They're making chocolates just for me. How touching. I must pay them back in some way. <clears throat> Townspeople of Suga Town. In order to commemorate Valentine's Day tomorrow, I will be hosting an event, Chocolates for Love. Huh? Chocolates for Love? Those who wish to profess their love should place their chocolates in the Town Hall Love Box. There will be a chocolate presentation ceremony, and those who receive chocolates must go on a date with the giver. What? What's going on? That's unfair. Over. Give me the. Ah! It's Suga tradition! Just live with it! Oh, tradition? Since when? Starting today! Now then, everyone come to the town hall. No question that the best chocolates are handmade from ingredients to decoration. How do we make it? The best ingredients make the best dishes. Way up in the Rocky Mountains, pure chocolate flows from a natural spring. And the sweetest, purest chocolate can be found on the peak at Chocolate Fountain. Uh -huh. The stuff at the bottom is of lower quality, uh -huh. so make sure you get some at the peak. Yes, sir. Let's go, Puka. Yeah. <laughs> oh, making your own chocolate, huh? Well, I can do even better. Fire! Toby! I really hate Valentine's Day! I really hate it! Looks like Captain's really sensitive. Yeah, it's probably because he never had a girlfriend. Stop your chattering and hurry up! Clear the way, please! Huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> 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 Chocolate fountain. Let's get some quick. Uh -huh. <laughs> <laughs> Finally, we have arrived. <gasps> that wasn't the top. Kevin, look over there. 
<gasps> Isn't that chocolate as well? <gasps> Captain, let's just get it from over there. Yeah, it's too tiring to go on. Mm. Okay, fine. Not like we're gonna eat it anyway. Go and get some. Thank you, Captain. <laughs> First, heat the pure chocolate. Once it comes to a boil, add sugar and spice. Pour it into the cast, and you're done. <laughs> As the chocolate boils, think about what shape you'd like the final product to be in. <laughs> that looks super easy. What do we do now? First, let's put it in the microwave oven for three minutes. Now, uh, we should freeze it in the freezer first. What? The secret ingredient is love. So everyone's working on the chocolate, right? Uh, Miss Ring Ring, the thing is, uh, we don't know how to make it. What? Such a simple thing. Uh, whatever. I mean, like big fancy stuff, you know? Add pretty colors. Like this. You got that. Uh, the shape should be like this. <laughs> and now it's time for Woo Ha! The presentation ceremony of the love chocolate. Woo Ha! What's his problem? Ugh. Valentine's Day is zero fun. <sighs> Shall we greet our first receiver of love, Fabio? Huh? <laughs> <laughs> and the giver was. Ching! <laughs> Um, thanks. <laughs> and according to Suga Island tradition, you shall enjoy a sweet date together. <laughs> Old friend, let's live together for a long, long time. <laughs> And now, for this chocolate box! Huh? Why are you coming out now? It's not time yet! Oh, you're so cute! Ho, ho, ho! W wait! There's my chocolate! What do you mean? Well, I, I thought you guys made that for me! Ah! This is for you! It's made with our love! <laughs> this is for you, made with our love! Yes, thank you! Oh, this can't be! This can't be! Now, the next recipient is... Garu! I think I might know who is giving you this chocolate. <laughs> Wait! Huh? This should be the chocolate Garu should get. Garu, whose chocolate will you take? Oh. Ah, this event is over! Now I'm in the future! Never again! Doga.
<laughs> Your clothes will be spiffy clean in a jiffy ching. Thanks. Have a great and pretty day. Oh, I'll be with you in a minute, Doga. You'll be with me now! <laughs> and remember to put them in the evil wash. Uh, we'll, we'll, we'll do. And no search! Socks go. <laughs> oh. oh, they're just socks. What could happen? Hmm, <laughs> fresh and clean. Smells pretty. Let's go be mean and nasty! No, Ching! People love you because you are so sweet and nice and nice! <laughs> Get lost, you duckling with wings! <laughs> Hi, Pooka! that did this. find my reindeer's antlers. <laughs> I've just been cloud jacked. All right, all right. Everyone calm down. I'll get to the bottom of this. Over. <laughs> Looks like someone pulled all the bolts from the scaffolding. Who would do such a mean thing? Over. I saw Puka here just a minute ago. She did it. Puka? Are you sure? Over. Yes. She's been doing things all over town. She's so mean. Hold it right there, Puka. Over. <gasps> Puka would never do such things. She's much too good. And sweet. Sorry, but Ching witnessed it, and someone as sweet as Ching would never lie. Holy waterwork! Is she hanging with a bad crowd? A cry for attention. Maybe we have failed in our duty as her guardians. Hold the rock! 
talkest about? Hey, Pooga, don't do that! Stay away from me, troublemaker! <laughs> This sock is going to be doing some hard time in jail. Over. <laughs> Amazing how one bad sock can spoil a whole watch. Move along, folks. Nothing to see here. Over and out. If that was someone else's sock, where is mine? Hmm. <laughs> It is a wonderful night for a beating, Gero. Your beating! Ow! All you have done is delay the inevitable. There is nowhere you can hide. I will even hunt you in your dreams. And your little girlfriend, too! <laughs> I wonder when Pooka and Garu will get here. The Queen will make her appearance soon. Pooka probably wants to make a quiet entrance. She's such a shy girl. over there. Hey! 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 
Many gurus, so little time. Kicking Garo's butt. This helicopter is only for official business, so scoot. Over. You too, Puka. Over. Nah. <gasps> officers Bocalate down. I repeat, Officers Bocalate down. Over. <laughs> the latte has been secured. Over. Uh, 
Sorry, Puka, but I don't have jurisdiction over the Swiss Alps. Over. Puka? Where'd she go? Over. <laughs> Welcome to the family, little man. Time for a fish! You're not from around here, are you, boy? They must not speak much from where he comes from. Who cares where he is from? Love is in the air! You don't like this glorious man, boy? It is part fun, too! <laughs> yeah, eat up. There's plenty. It'll put hair on your chest. <laughs> oh, looks like we are going to have ourselves a wedding! <laughs> oh! He's got so many cute little tricks! Come back here! No one's too good for my little girl! My papa, we have been seized by cheese! <laughs> my lot is getting away! Stop playing around in that fondu and get my man back! <laughs> <laughs> Yourself a spry one, huh? He sure knows how to ride a goat. <laughs> oh, that was a good one. It's only a matter of time before we're brothers. <laughs> It's a special day. We have finally found a good man to take care of my daughter and our whole family. <laughs> now, raise your glasses in a toast. So you think you can have my man? That little bundle of loaves is mine! Oh no! My chalet! In all my days, I shall never find another little cherub as cute as... Something 
like you've had a really bad day so far. Hey, I know it'll cheer you up. Let's spar. I Yesterday was Monday. To your x-ray, you've broken every bone I studied in medical school. And a few I didn't. So you need to rest. <laughs> oh! That's crazy, Garu. How could the same day be repeating over and over again? You need to go and see Master Sue. Hello? Are you here, Master Sue? It's Abio and Garu! Whoa, this must be some kind of calendar machine. Hmm, maybe it's broken. I bet it just needs a good kick. Everyone think you can fix something by kicking it. You have to punch it. <laughs> there, the problem is solved. Now go on and shoe already. Tomorrow will be a different day. Ha <laughs> ha! 
Beautiful. Our little girl has grown up so fast. <laughs> we are gathered here today to unite Garo and Puka in ho 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 holy. A badly dressed girl stuck to your tail. <laughs> <laughs> oh my! What a fashion disaster! <laughs> mm, this is a waste of time. Let's go. <laughs> what do you think, ladies? Star and no substance. He's so shallow, he's a bottle. He's perfect! <laughs> Greetings. We are from the house of Charlotte. This is Mr. Zoom, JT, and I am Starla. Um. Hiya! We've been on a worldwide quest in search of the chosen one, and we believe you are him. But first, you must take a test. You must pick your object that most deserves your love. Only the true chosen one will know. Mm. Ooh. Mm. <laughs> Ooh. Let's see enlightenment begin! Exfoliate, foundation, rouge, eyeliner, floss, gel, success! <laughs> People of Suga Village, I give you Fababio, the chosen one! We are gazing deeply into the empty nature of beauty, and its name is Bob Avdo! So, what makes you the experts? We were trained in the house of Charlot to achieve the ultimate height of fashion knowledge. But after the previous Chosen One lost his way and waistline, we set out in search of the next Chosen One. We have been traveling many years, but at last we have found him. Single file, ladies. There's plenty to go around. Yay! What words of wisdom do you have to share, oh insightful one? Tight pants need not be restricting. <laughs> hey, girls, care to join me on the path to enlightened emptiness at my new salon? <laughs> Where's that music coming from? Are you ready to forgive my beauties? <laughs> Hold it right there, Picret. Oh, aren't I on the guest list? I'll check. Nope, boys. <laughs> Abio? Yeah, can you keep it down here? You're filling up my emptiness. <sighs> okay, who wants a piece of me? <laughs> Good news, Bob. Mm, not much pow in this Kung Pao chicken. 
The time has come for you to leave, Suga, and go with us to the House of Shallow. Sir, you will spend the rest of your life leading us from inside a hermetically sealed salon. Hermetically sealed? That sounds great! <gasps> you aren't gonna take away my boyfriend! It'll be wise for you to mind your own business. This is now. <laughs> Don't worry. I still think you look fab, yo. 